Hi you guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for all your love and support. I truly do appreciate it. And welcome to those of you new that just joined. This is going to be a, a quick reading. There won't be an extended. I'm really um, challenged for time this week. This is a challenging uh, week for me. I will try to uh, get some additional videos in though uh, over the weekend um, to try to make up for it um, if I can and and if I'm mentally able to. <laughs> this is just a lot of stuff going on. Anyways, this is general. This is going to be a, a quick message, one clear message of what someone really needs to hear right now. So this is general. That means it's not going to resonate with everybody out there in the collective. So please keep that in mind. If it doesn't resonate, you know, no need to like you know say it don't resonate for you if it don't it don't not every reading is going to resonate with you okay so i do offer personal readings so if you're uh, interested in booking one of those with me that information is going to be below the video description where it says show more as well as all the decks i'm using here today the majority of the items you see will be listed below as well as my instagram and tiktok information sometimes i'm able to get on tiktok because i can do one minute videos so that would be definitely a, a good thing to join over there um all the uh, the buddha warmer the protection sprays and the candles are in my etsy shop including the twin flame uh, brace that i'm wearing for this reading okay so if you hear me say he or she when i talk about the masculine and the feminine i'm just talking about energies not a specific gender masculine or feminine could be male or female so just take it how it resonates or applies and the energies can definitely be flipped. So when I say I'm talking about you, I could be talking about your person. Only you will know how it makes sense for you, okay? So let's get one clear message of what someone really needs to hear right now. This is the Quantum Oracle. I'm going to get three cards here. Okay, so we have here family, friends, and guides. The honoring path milestone so you have completed a milestone uh, spirit is wanting you to know you are successful you've you've achieved something okay um, and your family friends and guys this even uh, you know uh, people from the other side are helping you to achieve this success you may be getting um, uh, recognition especially with this trophy for something you've done in public maybe some of you guys are getting awards but some kind of public recognition you have completed a milestone you're going to be successful or this has already happened and you need to know this okay so we have number six um, seven and six so sixes are about balance so you may be seeing the number sixes maybe even the number seven and with the seven are very spiritual numbers, so I do feel spiritual uh, um, angels and guys and loved ones from the other side have helped you to uh, achieve success and accomplish your goal. Whatever that is, you are being guided. They, You do have the support of the universe. That's the main message here around this energy. So if you were worried about it, if you're going to be successful, are you going to accomplish this goal? Are you going to be recognized? Yeah, this is happening or it's already happened. Okay, so let's get some more about uh, uh, additional uh, message uh, for this. What this has to do of what you are successful with, what they're helping you to achieve this milestone. So this is the Kipper deck. What is this successful achievement that you've been um, assisted with to help accomplish or receive this public recognition involving family, uh, friends, and guides? Okay, <laughs> so what I'm getting here is they're helping you to not be worried about whether you're going to date or not. And it also has to do with some of you guys with the courtship, this can be about meeting. So you are leaving the concerns uh, about a situation. You're, you don't have to worry of whether you're going to be successful. Or are you going to be accomplished this goal? Are you going to be recognized? Is this, are you, is this something that is just going to keep happening or have you finally meet this status? I feel that you have reached a milestone where you can let go of worry. You can leave that behind. 
okay, with this journey. Journey is about leaving or returning. This could also indicate somebody could be returning back. Somebody that is thinking about you. Maybe you're worried if this person is going to return. For some of you guys, that this has to do with dating. But a lot of you, this is, I feel like there's a date here or some type of meeting where you're worried if you can... If, if you're able to leave that worry behind, Spirit is saying, yes, you can definitely leave this uh, worry behind, whatever this is, okay? So I'm going to look further into what it might have to do with. What is this journey? That number 10 can be significant. We have another um, uh, threes. I see as prayers answered. It could have to do with other people. We do have family, friends, and guides there, but it's also a six. So this is about a balance, balance in your foundation. You'll be successful in your relationship um, as well. And we have 10, which there's an ending taking place, which brings about a new beginning. So what is this journey here for? What's this? This is the uh, Intuit Oracle. What is this journey? Yeah, it's time. It's perfect timing. Okay. Origins here. Um, stand the test of time, past, present, and future. Yeah. So... I feel like this could be somebody from your past, maybe that you're concerned about in the present and the future. So some of you guys, somebody could be returning. Um, and this also could be just about, it's time for you to leave the worry behind about whether uh, something is gonna take place or not, that it is gonna be successful. Um, there's uh, people helping and assisting you to take a uh, place. So just take it, you know, whatever message. That also is 19, which is another 10. So there's definitely some type of ending that is bringing about new beginning. And let me get another uh, card here under this uh, courtship. Yeah. <laughs> yes, spring into action, new beginnings. There's new beginnings. You have a date with a new beginning, okay? New beginning could be a new beginning in your goals, accomplishments, achievements, being recognized in the public, or you're going to have a new beginning that's going to bring about a new beginning with family, friends, and guides. That's going to give you, um, be able to leave the worry behind about a certain situation that you may be worried about because this indicates um, new beginnings, uh, fresh excitement, you know, things coming alive, growth. It's a new cycle. And yes, spring into action. This might have happened already. I think we're officially in the summer now and um, here in the United States. So this could have been something that just took place. You learned um, or somebody decided. But there's this is a very carefree uh, uh, energy is what I'm getting. This is taking place. Okay, so you can leave the, the worries um, behind. So what was this concern about? What was this concern about? And we have number eight that can be significant. You were concerned about whether things were working um, against you. If your persistence would pay off, it has. See, your persistence has paid off. So you may be worried about whatever work you put into family or friends or your um, spiritual path, uh, your your public. Um, I want to say accolades. But it's another word I'm kind of looking for here. You wanted to know if this has worked out or if, if you know, if the persistence that you've done is paid off or if something is worried about you. Uh, I mean, um, if it's working against you. And the only thing that'll be working against you will be your own mind and your concern is what I'm getting. Because it's saying new things are on the horizon. Okay? Determine a repetition. You're making dreams real. That's what you're doing. That's what's happening. That's what's taking place. Okay? So let's go ahead and see, um, let's get a few messages from whoever this may be coming through to communicate with you. This is my Cupid's Desires love messages. It does have some uh, sexual references. So if that is offensive to you, this would be a good time to click off. Also, um, if you're interested in purchasing any of my decks and you live in the United States, you can get it from my site or my Etsy shop only. Uh, if you're international, please send me an email below. So let's see what uh, someone would like to um, communicate, whoever this is. This could be a family, a friend, a friend, guide from somebody from the other, other side or love interest. What would they like to communicate? Lust. <laughs> Close the door and take off your clothes. So somebody has a lot of lust and desire for you, or this could just be your passions um, that is bringing about all this, this milestone and this achievement with someone this is connected to. And this is, yes, you are right. We can't 
just be friends because I want more. So this is somebody that you were in a friendship with that wants more. They want to date you. They want to come into a new beginning for some of you guys, okay? Um, yeah, so the answer is yes in that regard. And let's get one last message here. And then we have wet, drenched in your essence. So I feel like this person is just really feeling emotional about you. They do maybe have a lot of lust for you, a lot of passion, but I feel like it's it's about this. They're really feeling you, okay? They don't don't be worried about a certain situation. It is going to be accomplished. It will be successful. And I'm just going to get uh, this is the uh, Tarot of Dreams to go along with these cards of why this bless energy because this also could be you are closing up a, a door a, a cycle here um, of the past or someone is closing the past because um, of the back and forth uh, between you um, and they could be deciding you know to make a decision about their future and they could be closing the door on anything that you know took place uh, took place in the past and this could be a great achievement so let's get a card to go along with this less energy yeah, palace of coins. So some of you guys, you're leaving um, a job, a home, a house situation because you know it's time. It's time to close the door. It's time to close up the chapter in this palace of coins. So this is someplace physical in a 3D. Um, so definitely could be a job or home, okay? Palace of coin, um, a lot of times indicate a place where you live. So it could be a place where you, job sometimes can be a place like where you live, where you frequent that place a lot, okay? And this may have taken you a long time to get there, but you've, you've got, you've, you made it. So let's get some more about this, uh, yes, the energy. Yes, it's going to be a brand new beginning. Something that is emotional. An offer. Yes, there is going to be an offer of, of dating. Somebody is coming back towards you. You don't have to worry about this. Some of you guys, this will be a new love. And some of you guys, this is somebody from your past that is a part of your present and will be a part of your future. I'm getting that a very strong message there. Okay. And then let's get this last card for the sweat drenched, drenched in your essence energy. Yeah, the star card. Wishes making dreams real. <laughs> Don't worry. Your dreams are coming true. You worried about it. It's going to happen because someone wants to heal things with you for some of you guys. And this is you healing from whatever took place in the past. Healing, um, you know, a, an accomplishment, making your dreams come true, successful, where you're not worried about anything anymore. You are receiving the assistance. And I feel like there's going to be family um, and friends and guys that are instrumental in this connection. Okay. Uh, with the star card, some of you guys could be dealing um, with an Aquarius or you could be an Aquarius or Aquarius in the equation. But this is about major healing and renewal uh, after going through something traumatic. So your dreams are coming true. It, it says this, there's no worry. This is, you are gonna feel this, that somebody is really feeling your essence. Um, and it could be a, a person that was a, a friend or family that is uh, helping to bring this about as well. Okay, all right, you guys. So I hope that resonated for you. If it did, please like the video, comment. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Um, normally, I do have extendeds, but like I said, I'm pressed for time. So if you want to check out a previous extendeds, um, they are in my Patreon. That link is below. And there's probably like, I don't know, maybe close to 200 videos over there. So if you want to check that out, go right ahead. So thank you guys so much uh, for watching. You guys have a wonderful day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. And until next time, next video, peace, love, and light.